what do we have here? It looks like we have many ancient Indian burial tombs in the shape of domes. As you can tell, what have we have, do we have here? Oh, that's hard. Oh, wow. My goodness. Let's examine it a little bit further. Look at this ancient concrete. Check it out. Uh, actually, it's not. It's not concrete. It's coral. Or coral. And, uh, of all places, it formed however many thousands of years ago, maybe even longer. Near what you can see, there's a dry lake bed over there, and the water line must have surely been above this for these little domes to form. But, uh, it's kind of an odd thing because when you look at this coral, it's been fossilized. You can see a little, uh, little stone stuck into that. But the odd thing about this is that when you analyze and look at coral, coral throughout the world, you don't usually see it form like this. And these little uh, domes. It's kind of odd. So, uh, it's just some food for thought. If only we could access the space-time continuum and see this stuff when it was submerged and how it formed. Now that would be interesting. But, uh, somehow, uh, this has been cracked open. I think someone cracked open a few of these just to say, hey, what's, what's inside these things, man? Maybe some ancient aliens, you know, buried some kind of treasure in it, you know? <laughs> Obviously not. But, uh, coral in a place where there's no water is somewhat interesting. <laughs>